Hello there once again, I'm Peter Vaughan, and here's another chapter of Name of the Day. We're up to looking at the letter N. Now I've spoken quite a lot about the letter N and its shape and its meaning. And I'll give you a bit more of an explanation. N, when you're looking at the top of a letter and the bottom of the letter, letter and you've got the past and the future, everything is always moving in this direction. People are always learning, and behind them, they have a wealth of knowledge, stuff that they've learned coming up behind them. When it gets to a point where they're learning something new, all this past history here spills over and helps add a new foundation for a new block of knowledge to be built and climb up here as per the future so it can be ready to move on again and so forth. The number that belongs to the N the number 14, before it becomes a 5, it means one, me, I have skills, I have skills. The four are the skills or the ability to learn stuff at a hands-on level. Practical, being able to work with the raw materials to bring them into something far more useful. And the 5 down here says, well, whatever it is that you want to make them into, I can do that. And that is the letter N. So we'll put Nigel as a name, and we'll put Natalia as another name. Right, having a look then at the N, which is a value 5 letter, the I is 9, G is 7, E is 5, and L is 3. 5, 1, 2, 1, 3, 9, 1. Note that in Natalia, there are three A's. And as I have mentioned in other name analysis, the letter A represents an ox's head in hieroglyph format. There's the ox's head and there's the yoke that's over its shoulder. This is like a shorthand for, uh, for pictures. And when we had, in the old days, people had to dig a field up with their hands by digging with a spade, or they got an ox fitted a yoke to its shoulders, which uh, hooked it up to some you know, leather straps and said, right here, come along, and they had a plough behind it and it ploughed the ground out. It did work very, very fast. Of course, as I've mentioned before also, Phoenicians and Romans changed it round from that shape to that shape, which is what we have today, and it represents a major change in the life or living conditions when it applies at certain times. That is ready for another lesson. So let's add up Nigel. 5 and 9, 14, 21, 26, 29. Which reduces to 11, which reduces to a 2 by adding up the double numbers. On Natalia, 5 and 1 is 6, 7, 8, 9, and 3 is 12, 21, 22. And that's a 4. Sometimes it's interesting how just purely putting names up on the boards, I see double numbers, like we have here and again here. When you're seeing different people's names and what they're like, this is their personality. And Nigel are people who work with details at the very foundation of their makeup. They're details people. And they like to new, look at new things and identify problems and fix them. So they're pretty good at saying, hmm, I wonder what's wrong here. And they'll open up the, the uh, manual, they'll flip the pages over, and they're researching it. Ah, got it. And they'll then go ahead and fix things with the information at hand. They work with detail in the area where people are required for service. So it doesn't matter what area it is, they provide services for other people at finite or minuscule levels, very tiny working areas, so other people might get oh, annoyed with it and want to move on. No, these people are sticklers for punishment <laughs> for doing the things that other people don't like to do. So Nigels are detailed people, and they can uh, work in a multitude of areas because they've got the skills or the base with that N up front here, and the ability to express what they're saying to others whenever they need to talk about what they're doing. With Natalia, the same N applies. 
the ability to work with new areas of knowledge and technology and build it up behind them and deliver it to the future. With the A at the end of the name here, just as Nigel will express it, Natalia will act upon it. It's like, just get it done. So they see what the issue is. They get on with the job to get it done. They like to do it with everything in order, in place, so that we know where things are, when they are, why they're there, and the extent of the stacking and racking and packing. The four down the bottom says they don't normally think that other people could do the job very well, so they do it themselves. Even if they go up in the ranks with whatever they're doing, they don't really feel comfortable teaching other people to do things because either they don't listen or they're just not up with the play. So the name Natalia then is a name that says, I take specific care of the details right down to the nth degree because they Number two represents smaller things, details, what you shouldn't overlook. And the number four says, I'll get on with the work and do it myself. Interesting. Work. It's a four-lettered word. <laughs> so therefore, look at that. What about its numbers? Five, six, nine, and two. Just get that from up at the top up there. And we're looking at this, we'll go five and six is 11 and nine. 20 and 2 is 22. So isn't it interesting that Natalia and work relate to the same number? This is why it's fascinating, the subject about name analysis. So if you know a Nigel or a Natalia, let them know what we're doing here and get them to look at it and see what they think and what you think of their names as well, especially if you know them. So thanks for watching. Click the like button and even hit the subscribe button. And as Peter always says, everything is in a name. Hi, Peter here again. If you liked what you saw, I have a full personality profiling service, but not just from your first name, from your whole name and your date of birth. The report covers your hidden skills and talents, what motivates you, how others see you, and much, much more even an in-depth forecast. Follow the link in the description below for more direction. And again, thanks for watching.